This is the crankshaft. I'm just cutting. And you can see that I've cut most of the way through that. And I'm gonna replace this center section. So that is the crankshaft. Cut that piece of scrap. I've welded in a bit of EN24 bar to replace where the crank was in here. And I'm just gonna put that back into the transmission. So that's what's left of the crank. Uh, ignition pickup, CDI unit, flywheel. Um, some other bits of weight that have been left out which leaves me the gearbox, which is back together now. Don't know if you can see in there, that's the shaft I made to replace the crank. I'll put a cover over this section here, just to close it up. I've disconnected the oil pump, so it's just literally gonna be a gearbox uh, with oil sitting in the bottom and electric starter. Uh, I've got a shaft coming out of it currently which has got a keyway on it, which I need to connect to this shaft. So it probably won't be anywhere near that long. Uh, and that will give me an electric starter for the rotary engine, uh, reverse, and three forward speeds. Uh, a bit of extra weight. I can lose a lot of this case and mount them much closer together. This has a rubber coupling joint in there, which would be quite useful to dampen out any vibrations. That's it for this section.